receive or conquer. O, overcomer. R, restoration. N, naked. E, encourage. R, renew. S, shepherd. T, thanksgiving. O, obedience. N, newness. E, election. We are more than conquerors through Christ who loves us. It wasn't easy getting here. Lots of heartache, bitterness, and remorse. But we overcame by the blood of the Lamb. Restoration is in full effect as little by little we put the past behind us. For Hebrews 4 verse 13 says, Neither is there any creature that is not manifest in his sight, but all things are naked and open to the eyes of him who we, who we have to do. Let us continue to encourage each other as we try to do our best to walk the walk and talk the talk so that we can renew our relationship with God and grow from strength to strength. The Lord is our shepherd, we will not want. So we are giving thanks unto the Lord for his goodness towards us and for all the things he has brought us through. Let us be obedient to his word, for the word of God is life. So we also should walk in newness of life. And besides all, all this, giving all diligence, add, your, add to your faith virtue, then knowledge, temperance, patience, Brother, brotherly kindness and charity to make your calling and, and election sure. M. Mission. I. Increase. S. Salvation. S. Singing. I. Inspiration. O. Obtain. N. Noise. C. Cornerstone. H. Holiness. U. Uprighteousness. Our righteousness, C. Court, H. Honor. We are on a mission to win souls for Christ. We will plant the work. The Lord will water it, cause it to grow, and send the increase. Salvation will come to your loved ones and all those you, you've been earnestly praying for. Sing a new song unto the Lord. Sing, sing to the Lord and praise Him. Be an inspiration to people all around you. Let your light so shine before men, so they will see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. For whosoever finds Christ, finds life, and shall obtain favor of the Lord. So make a joyful noise unto the Lord, everyone, and come into his presence to sing. First Peter chapter 2 verse 6 says, Behold, I lay in Zion a chief cornerstone, elect, precious, and he that believeth on him shall not be confounded. Who is like unto thee, O Lord, among the, the gods? Who is like thee, glorious in holiness, fearful in praises, doing wonders? Let's continue to walk the path of uprightness. For righteousness exalts a nation, but sin is not re reproached to many man. So enter into his courts with lots of praise, and honor the Lord with your substance and with the first fruit of all thy increase. So shall thy barn be filled with plenty, thy presses shall burst out with new wine. Proverbs 3, verse 9 to 10.